Hi everybody, it's Joan Taffender, and I am doing an update for Jessica, baby baby, she's right here. <laughs> um, this is her one year update, and I've been meaning to do this for the last couple of days, and um, it's now like almost 7 o'clock, and if you hear noise, it's our neighbors are having a party, and I've, I've just, um, I don't know, the time has gotten away from me, and I was running out to get the, it's a birthday party here, you want to come say hi? You want to come say hi, baby baby? Look at your baby baby. She's having a pear right now. So, <laughs> you see? <laughs> yeah, this little letter, 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 letter. Letter, 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 letter. Can you do it? Letter, 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 letter. That's one of the things she learned. Um, so she's been saying a lot of words, actually. How cute, how cute. Okay, and then um, the cool thing is, is she is finally over like all these horrible viruses and okay so as soon as she was over all the viruses she got a little rash on her back and so what we have come to well through a series of events that happened at the beginning of April um, we came to the conclusion that um, that she that she uh, has some type of either like allergy or sensitivity to mold and she has this weird rash and um, maybe I can try to show it to you. Come here, Jessie, because I'm gonna get her ready for bed soon. So I'll just get her, I'll show it to you. Like, here, Jess, let's go show, show the rash. We're gonna show them the rash. And so, anyway, this rash, um, it's a pretty serious thing. And, um, but let me first tell you the words she said. She said, she says, hi. She says, uh, mama, dada. She says, um, what else does she say? Oh my gosh, up. She says, you saw her letter, 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 <laughs> letter, letter, letter. And then, um, what else? That's not a word, actually. <laughs> Duh. Um, what else does she say? She says, um, what other words do you say? You see, bird? One of her first words was bird. Um, she'll say bird, and then um, what else do you say, little one? Um, bird up. Um, bubble. She's trying to say bubba, bubble. Can you say bubble? She's trying to, like, she's trying to say whatever words we say and, like, try to teach her. So it's, um, it's really really fun it's getting so much fun she's a lot of work she's still a little clingy and I've been trying to figure out a way to like teach her to like learn to play on her own hold on the Jessie girl I want to show your rash I want to show let me see okay now this I don't know if you can see it very well let me see let me see can we see it very well on here now see it actually looks pretty darn better right now it was like I don't know if I can leave some pictures but um actually looks a lot better but um so what I was I've been doing a lot of research on the mold now so it's um uh I don't know we're gonna see if she has the genetic predisposition to have a bad ability to detox mold um and I don't know we we've already started this pretty massive cleanup in the house, um, making a whole separate video series on it because, I don't know, my husband suggested that we do it just so, you know, you can see or people can learn from it or whatever. So I'm giving her um, uh, about five, yeah, <laughs> 500 milligrams or up to a thousand milligrams of vitamin C every day. I'm a little bit doing more hit or miss with that bottle, that immune system thing that I made for her. Essentially in that immune, immune thing, it was mainly the bottle um, at her 11 month update, I talked about it. Um, there was mainly like probiotics, vitamin C, oh do 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 you see you? So um, I'm gonna have to uh, stop this minute because I have to change her soon. So, um, how's this little one? How's my little Bubba? Um, so anyway, so things are, you know, they're progressing and they're going good and they're much, much better, but, um, yeah, so, um, trying to think what the main, the biggest thing she did this, this last month was talk a lot and we progressed to finally getting out of that horrible, horrible thing of, um, of being sick but oh the other things that are still going on that rash on her back that I showed you and then also congestion in her nose and back of her throat we're still gonna go see another um, another ENT for second opinion but essentially we're gonna do the testing that dr. 
Richie Shoemaker is the is his name, and he has a, a, a website called Surviving Mold. And so that's what we're going to follow. We're going to actually ask the the allergy immunologist doctor to, to run those lab tests um, on Wednesday. We have an appointment this coming Wednesday, and um, so we're going to be asking him to run. It's like the TP Beta One. I'm not saying it right. MSH. There's a bunch that I've actually never really heard a lot about. I was looking over there. Okay. Um. Actually, let me run and get it quick. Can you say hi to everybody? Can you say hi to everybody? Okay, so I'm back. Let me just tell you some of these labs on here and um, and then I guess I'll let you know how it goes. Essentially, I have MSH um, and I, mel, melanocyte uh, stimulating hormone and then there's TGF beta one, that's what it's called. Transforming growth factor beta one, I guess if, um, Letter, 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 I mean, there's a whole, this whole thing is from Surviving Mold. Um, I'm going to see if I can actually leave a link. It's called Diagnosis Lab Test. I'll leave a link underneath it. There's, I don't know, there's about eight or nine different labs on here. We're going to, um, and I don't, I'm so not familiar with them. So we're going to, God willing, the, the allergy immunologist doctor will run these tests for me. Um, I, I ordered his book, Dr. Ritchie's book, which is called um, Surviving Mold. He's got another one called Mold Warriors, I think. Um, <clears throat> anyway, um, we had a really, really fun birthday party, and I'm not sure if I'm going to leave it in, in, her, um, in this update or if I'll do it separately. Um, she loves bubbles. She was laughing her head off. She loves the bubbles. Um, and we went to church today, finally, after so many weeks and months, actually, of not getting to church. And her rash actually got better in a couple of hours. So that was huge. And um, so, yeah, um, keep you posted on what happens, I guess, with all this in the next month of how we're going to deal with this mold issue. And, um, and yeah, and then how she progresses with her health, and we'll see if she has the genetic predisposition to be a bad detoxer of mold. And all those tests will tell you, I guess, there's one called H, hold on, let me look, Jessie girl, let me look real quick. This one's called um, HLDR, and that's the genetic one. And I think you can order that from Life Extension uh, on your own. I have to actually look that up. I'll be doing that this week and, and hopefully ordering that. And yeah, so, um, Honey, was there anything else she did the first year besides say a lot of words that was really cool? I, I don't know. Four wheel drive walking. Four wheel drive walking, what's that? Up and down hills, slopes, like she did oh. the last couple of weeks. Well, he calls it four wheel drive walking. But sometimes she has to crawl. So we have this tiny, oh right, okay, so she's getting better at walking. She's getting faster, she's getting stronger. She's um, more, confident more, more confident. Yeah, you little baba, look at you, little mama. I call her my little mama girl. And she gives like this, you precious baby. Precious baby, baby, baby. Okay, all right guys, I don't know. I'm having a lot of fun with her. She's a lot of fun, she's a real joy, in spite of how much work she is. I mean, there's a ton of stuff we have to do, obviously. But it's actually a lot of fun. And I'm going to go because I need to change her and get her ready for bed. So anyway, guys, nice talking to you. And I will see you in the next update or the next video. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.